know, right? Does it float? Yeah, float straight to the bottom. <laughs> Pretty good. Great. Yeah, it's shallow. It's all pat down. Yeah. And that's like a perfect spot for like drinking though. Yeah. Like it's too small for like a boat, I'm guessing. Oh look at that beaver lodge. We made it to camp. It is uh, 8.10. We didn't really film anything today because it was a real slog. <laughs> it was rough. It was really rough. <laughs> so uh, now we're just cooking up some din din and uh, we're going to take a celebratory, celebratory shot because uh, it was a really long, hard day. <laughs> so uh, let's do it up. Cheers! Oh, that's good stuff. Oh, it's nice and sweet. Oh. Oh, I think we're gonna drink all of this. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Going down tonight. <laughs> Look at that there, bud. Ho ho ho, it's a bit ricky. Oh, the rock fell. Oh. That's not good, that rock was perfectly positioned. Good morning. 
I am exhausted. Uh, I don't think I slept too much. Maybe. Well, I'm pretty puffy. I think I slept 15 minutes. Pretty darn sore. Looking forward to uh, starting the day though. It's supposed to be rainy, but uh, if I can get a couple hours, or at least a morning of sun, that's good stuff. Time for a coffee. All right, it's time for the campsite tour. Uh, last night it was a bit too dusky to show you, but uh, now that it's day, the next day I can show you what we're dealing with. Oh, there's Rye in the distance. Tent. The boat. Really nice fire pit here. Overlooking the Bandit Lake. Nice place to sit. Second campsite's over there. There's Mr. Breakfast Delivery Man. Ahoy! <laughs> Ahoy there, stranger. Ahoy there. And here's some extra wood for tonight. So, uh, we got the island site, and the site goes like all the way back there, like forever. We haven't even explored it because it's a really big island. Maybe we'll do that today. But it's a pretty decent site. Oh, yeah, there's a cup holder. Yeah. That's so cool. A lot of butts. Alright, so uh, we had breakfast. It was good. We had some snacks. Cleaned up the campsite, cleaned up the fire pit, uh, started to rain a little bit. Ooh. So we got our ponchos on. And now, I think we're just gonna explore the island. See how far back it goes. See if there's any interesting things out there. Try and stay dry. Can't swim? No. Well, there's more poo. Maybe. This is a pretty big spot. Do you need prints? No. I mean, that could be like baby prints. Small hoof. Hard to tell. This ground is like really hard to track in. Yep. Alright, I think this is the end of the island. We explored it. Um, we found a ton of moose poo. And we're thinking maybe the moose come here to like give birth or something because it's kind of like uh, cut off from the mainland so maybe it's like safer from predators or something but it's just like moose poo every like six steps it's just crazy so we reached the other side and uh, 
Portage is over there. That's where we came in. Today we've seen probably six canoes come on this lake. So either they're like passing through or one of them is going to be our neighbor. So we're not sure. But anyway, I'm going to keep exploring the island. That's that. The water in. That's so cool. Yeah, I want to see. There's some birds over there. Yeah. Started raining again. Oh, these ones are standing up. So crazy. Capturing all the action. A day in the life. Uh oh. That's, that's bad. Oh man. I think the inside's okay though. Yeah, nothing we can do about it anyway. Helen to the finest <laughs> <laughs> to the finest measurements. You <sighs> yourself when you're out here. <laughs> oh. So you're your exact weight. Your finest dark blue jeans. <laughs> Precise <laughs> like new. Millimeter. <laughs> of of your new wilderness waist. <laughs> You'll lose inches in seconds. Ooh. Good day! And welcome to day three. We are still on Bandit Lake. 
after a very wet and soggy evening. The rain did not stop. That's Algonquin for you. It's supposed to be light rain, but it turned out to be rain. 100% chance constantly. Uh, so we couldn't really... Well, we still did a lot. We explored the island. We went fishing three times, two or three times. It was good, but everything was wet. We managed to get a really good fire going. We had a really good dinner. And our sleep was better than last night. So now we're just packing up and uh I'll show you the lake here. Now we're just packing up and we're gonna hit the river, hit the lake. First we're gonna, I think it's Juan Lake first and then uh, no, Moccasin, Juan, Jubilee, something like that. Anyway, that's it. We're done here. So long, Bandit Lake. Everything's all cleaned up. The last dry spot in Algonquin. <laughs> Everything else is drippy. It's time to load and launch. Right. Well, we are on to one. Yeah, we're back. So we decided every portage, we're gonna do a shot of port. Makes sense. And this way we'll lighten the load. So <laughs> this is uh, number two, so I guess we have to do two shots. <laughs> <laughs> Bottoms up. Cheers. Oh man, that's so good. Two for the show, pretty. You gotta do two, right? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I knew it was do two. <laughs> but I mean, that was for Moccasin. He says, for one. For one. For one. One for all. <laughs> all, for all. All, all for one. <laughs> <laughs> Smaller shots, right? Smaller shots. <laughs> For some back in. <laughs> that was smaller than the other one. Yeah, no. Okay. From now on, smaller shots. Because I'll be drunk by the time I get to Sawyer Lake. <laughs> Alright. We have work to do. So, we'll check in.
Oh, it's the bug man. It's the bug man. So we made it to Rain Lake today, really good time. And uh, now we've got a site, and now we're just looking for wood. And found the thunder box here. This site's really cool, it's on the south side, and there's like a nice like trail running behind it. And, wow. Quite a bit of blow down in here. So, and the black flies are out too. But the good thing is they're not biting, they're just like landing on our faces. So, it's kind of annoying but it's not painful, so that's good. We grinded the bear hang. Pretty good. Let's see what else is back here. It's boggy. Whoa, I don't know if you can hear the flies, but they're out. But they don't have their teeth yet. Well, we've been out on Rain Lake for a couple hours and <laughs> we've caught zero fish. Zero. How many have you caught? Uh, yeah. Zero. <laughs> zero. Not one, not two. Nuns. So, uh, we don't know if there's any fish in here or what. We tried every lure in the box twice. Zero. <laughs> you can barely see us. We are in bed. Hello. <laughs>
Got our, our jammies on and we are uh, <clears throat> trying to stay warm. It's pretty freaking cold. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so we're just bundled up. We got our sweats on. <laughs> Except for Ryan, <laughs> he's got his good dark jeans on. So, that was pretty funny. So, uh, yeah, we'll be <laughs> shivering until dawn, it looks like. We'll see. We're bumping zippers tonight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, our sleeping bags open, uh, facing each other, so. <laughs> it makes for interesting night encounters. Okay. okay. <laughs> it's gonna be a rich and green. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. Yeah, you were heard it here first, folks. Alright. That's it. Oh, my battery's going low. Nighty night. Oh. Good morning, and welcome to day four. Last night was really, really, really cold. And uh, I said we were sh gonna shiver ourselves to sleep, and that's, that's exactly what happened. We were shivering all night long. We both had our toques on, our sweats on, sweaters, big socks. And uh, it was really cold, so I don't know, probably, uh, I don't know how cold it was, we don't have a thermometer, but we'll have to check when we get back. But we managed to sleep in somehow, so that's the best sleep we've had this whole trip, which is really odd, because it's the coldest. Um, so now we're just packing up, we're going to have a little quick breakfast, hit the water. Of course, there's a headwind, there's always a headwind, when you don't want a headwind. But uh, we're going to hit it, maybe we can do a few casts. Last night I saw a bunch of fish, some good sized fish. We didn't actually, we weren't able to catch anything, but uh, we'll probably head out soon. Unfortunately, it's like the most beautiful day of the whole trip here. So yeah, it's like an ideal camping day. Beautiful sun, beautiful sky, not too many bugs. So that's that, the morning report.
See that part there? That's the crane. <laughs> this is the wreck. It's really floating on top now. It's so crazy. Ah, I can't even hold it. I'm going to do some more of It wasn't that relaxed. It was on the trap. I had him pretty relaxed. You pretty relaxed? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, let's sleep was nice for a Ah. Uh. I guess it takes me four days to get used to the wood going on. That's what it's like. Like, you really get into your groove after four days. Uh. I did wake up on another day. Yeah. I feel like I can also time Yeah, that's the thing. Like, you really get into your group. You know what you need to do, you know what you're... How would you take one strap on the boat? Now that we know, we have to flip those things. Smile to yeah. your friends. Oh, God, I'm in my boots. Ah! Yeah. Ooh! Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, oh. <sighs> my legs are cracking. Yeah, I didn't know how early it was, but it was right. 